In this After Effects tutorial, let's practice creating compositions within compositions. You can see these slides at hunkim.com slash composition. So we find three pictures. For example, you can find these wallpapers at interfacelift.com and you go to File Import in After Effects. So we imported these three pictures named Pick 1, Pick 2, Pick 3. You can see that we're in the project panel. So now we go to Composition, New Composition. So now that we're inside Comp 1, we're going to drag Pick 1 into this comp. So here's Pick 1, drag it in. So we go to Composition, New Composition a second time. So here's the Composition tab. And now we're going to drag Pick 2 and Pick 3 onto this comp. So here's pick two and then pick three. You may have to resize some some uh, of these pictures. Notice how we're inside comp two. So now that we're inside comp two, you can see it over here. We click on one of the pictures. So click on one of the pictures. We apply Gaussian blur. So search up this effect called Gaussian blur. Double click it to apply it and just drag out this blurriness setting, it will blur. It goes to show you that within a composition that contains multiple images, we can decide which specific images has different effects. Click on the project tab up here, then double click comp1. You can see comp1 was the other composition that contained one image. We now drag in comp2 into the comp1 screen. You are allowed to drag a comp into another comp. That's very interesting. You now see three pictures. Comp2 is now inside of comp1. Here's comp2 and this was the comp1. You can see that comp2 is within comp1 but we can apply an effect to the entire Comp2 composition. We apply Hue Saturation, see settings above. So here's the hue that we searched for, double click Hue Saturation assuming that Comp2 is selected. And as we colorize and drag out the color hue, you notice that we can actually make this green. So everything within the Comp2 is affected all in one shot. Compositions can contain compositions. This allows you to apply special effects to multiple layers in one shot. This can save you time. Congratulations, you now have one more tool to create awesome videos, and we deserve a nice happy face. Let's get the smile. Congrats.